property value will likely double by 2030 in Greater Vancouver. Own your life. In this episode, we will cover how and why your Greater Vancouver property will likely double again in the next six years. Hi, I'm Jesse Johnson, guiding you with almost 18 years experience as a mortgage broker and realtor. CMHC, AKA the Canadian Mortgage Housing Corporation is generally known for being a conservative organization when sharing predictions. After all, they are run by the government of Canada. CMHC just predicted Greater Vancouver Homes to increase by at least 89% over the next six years. Considering how conservative they are and they're using inaccurate underreported immigration numbers by the federal government, this number will likely be over 100%, which equates double your current home value. Canada needs 3.5 to 4 million additional housing units by 2030 in order to restore affordability. Furthermore, I don't think that takes into account all of the immigrants, student visas and overstays. Do I see all these new housing units built in time? Definitely not. However, the province is finally making better decisions toward increasing the housing supply. But we're not going to really know the success of this until closer to 2030. At the time of this recording, the average Greater Vancouver home is worth about $1.2 million. Now, to be clear, this is not a house. This is all property types, which include condos, townhomes, and detached homes. The average Greater Vancouver condo currently sits at 770,000. The average Greater Vancouver or Metro Vancouver, same thing, townhouse currently sits at 1.1 million. And the average Greater Vancouver detached home is currently valued at $2 million. Let's keep in mind that these, again, they're the average per property type. There's nothing special about these properties. Greater Vancouver properties historically double every 10 years. But if you add the crazy amounts of immigration on top of declining new housing, I mean, it's a real recipe for disaster for future buyers or a massive opportunity today. Will all of these immigrants stay in Canada or better yet, Greater Vancouver? Probably not. Once they get here and realize how disgustingly expensive it is and hopes of ownership are slim to none, they will likely go somewhere else, but it's probably gonna take a few years to depart. Although it may seem impossible, these projections are based on a relatively modest 15% increase in housing prices over the next six years. Keep in mind, without all of these crazy immigration numbers, the past four years have seen prices climb by 36%, over double the current CMHC projection. Did you know that building permits are at 20 year lows? What? This is the opposite of what needs to happen in order to avoid the successive property value growth. Mortgage rate markets appear to finally have peaked, putting us in a declining rate environment. Things are gonna kick into high gear once the mortgage rates finally drop approximately 1% and continue to drop roughly another 1% between 2025 and 2026. Rental rates are at an all time high, more than ever people are considering potentially buying instead of renting. Now let's decode why buying now is a genius move. When interest rates tick up, it's not all doom and gloom. In fact, it often means more room to negotiate on property prices. And with the current rate scenario, this is a window of opportunity. Nice. While I have your attention, if you like this content, please hit the like button and subscribe to help me with the algorithm if you haven't already. Imagine this, it's 2030. You're looking out your window at the breathtaking Vancouver view and you're not just daydreaming. This is your view because six years ago, you made the move to invest when the market was ripe for the taking. Your net worth is up, likely around $1 million as well. Sounds like a future you'd love? Well, make it happen. Take action and thank yourself later. Don't let this chance slip away. Keep in mind, if you think it's hard to qualify now, it's gonna be a hell of a lot worse in a few years when prices skyrocket. Substantially more down payment will likely be required as well. I recommend you complete a quick process of getting a mortgage pre-approval. My mortgage team can help. You can book a time to talk with me and the link is below in the description. Mortgage approvals, they're free. And if done right, you will learn a lot of valuable information about your own situation and the market. Talk to a real estate pro, get your questions answered and start your journey. Whether you're a first home buyer or a seasoned investor, 
take this opportunity seriously. Well, that's a wrap with today's golden nugget of real estate wisdom. Remember, in Vancouver's dynamic market, timing is everything. If you've enjoyed this video, you'll probably like this one too. Again, I'm Jesse Johnson guiding you with over 17 years of expertise. Don't forget to grab a copy of my best selling book, Rockstar Real Estate Investing for more in depth information. The link to purchase the book on Amazon is posted in the description. Remember to own your life. Have a nice day. Bye bye. Property value will likely double by 2020. Uh, why is it not working? <coughs> Excuse me. But if you, oh my God, I hate this thing. Come on.